switch on my studio setup. Switch off my studio setup. So let's start the room tour. It is not as clean as you would expect. This is the entrance. And you come in. So these are some of the shoes that I have. And this was the package I received. So behind this, I have this space where I have some cartoons. You might be seeing it's messed up, but this is like the storage space. I clean it sometimes. Light is not good. So there are some more shoes, and this is pretty much when you enter the room. You have a light here. Okay, get the idea. And then you have this entrance which doesn't have a door surprisingly. You have the waste management here. First you can see a rack which looks really haphazard but everything is planned. So on the top you have some painting materials. Sometimes I paint. And here you have some kind of uh, books, batteries, extra batteries, some bike materials, room freshener and all the utensils that I use for cooking. I have kept it like this. I don't have a proper polished set, set up. And here you have, I have my brush and everything and some more utensils and these are I think some materials from two years, last two years, two delft uh, study materials. I might sell them, I mean I'm not going to sell them but I'm going to donate it someone or maybe give, give it to someone if it is useful so these are some of the packages that I received this chair I was using before using that gaming chair that you see there but uh, this chair this thing is not that comfortable so now it is having so many stuff but normally this is like another chair which I was using before and this is another chair this yoga mat is like a waste mat now with so many stuff lying on it so yeah so when you enter from here uh, then on the this side you have this study space which you might have seen in the workspace tour or coffee tour and the heater heater you can always control from 0 to 5 turn it on and off it is centrally connected so what happens is there is water inside this heater it gets steam when you open it by this knob you get steam and that steam heats it and it's pretty hot so it is sufficient and normally the glasses are double glazed so this is like a curtain on this side where I'm walking and here you get the view maybe in the morning I can show you here you get the view of the uh, morning space so this is a huge window and you can also open it I can show you in the morning so this is the morning view let us see. Well, month of December. So here there are a few houses and it's more nature if you have seen my videos and blogs. Nice early sunrise. And uh, here I have some garbage or storage, whatever you can say. At the end of the video, I'll show you all these lights are connected by smart lights. So with the click of a button, you can switch them off. And on this side, on the right, you have the kitchen space. So all the things that you see in this room, surprisingly, I bought it. So it was an unfurnished house. It has nothing. It is completely empty. And this flooring is hardwood flooring. So floor is, the quality of the floor is really good. And all the standing lamps, furniture, everything has been bought from IKEA. It took me two weeks to assemble them. So that is also the reason why I was not sure which things I'll keep where. So all these boxes that you see on the top, they are this light. So each box had one of these standing lamps which I assembled. And the furniture and everything, everything was bought from IKEA. Nothing was there in this house. So this chair, this chair which has also a lot of stuff, this table, this dressing table or the box, whatever you can say. 
So there's some books. This is the air fryer, uh, which I use occasionally. A lot of new stuff arrived. I have to clean it so that the waste mat becomes comes back to the yoga mat. Some bags, which I regularly use. The two bags. Let before going to the other room. Let me show you this room. So these are beautiful plants which I got two three months back. You have to water them like twice a week. The aloe vera and this is a coffee plant. This aloe vera was dead. I have to. I had to revive it. it was given by some of my friends. So, yeah, this is the fridge which I also bought. It was not there, and they have given four gas stove, which is really good. It doesn't look that clean. And this water heater, obviously, I bought it. You have this nice. It's kind of a mica covering on the top. and you can put hot stuff or you can put a cover it's really good and you have a chimney which is again good part yeah so whenever you cook something anything oily or something and you also have a window on this side so if you want a proper ventilation you can open this and also open this window and in the morning you get nice ventilation and in the room also they have some opening on the top here for ventilation so on this side you can see some houses different houses it's very cold so in the morning i'll show you this two windows and what is outside because i have also got a storage space a parking a barbecue area a common garden a private garden there are many things that i have got outside with 500 euros it's really good i think now i pay like 530 uh, 540 530 or 40 initially i was paying 500 when i came here Yeah, so this is like the utensils, um, some bottles, some stuff, the oven, and these cupboards were there before. So all the cooking stuff, pickles, everything. Like some cupboards have masala, some cupboards have dosa mix, the typical Indian things that you see. The golgappa, mongfali, which is like the peanuts, and all the storage like the lentils, rice, tissue paper, cooking. tea here all the cleaning stuff below the sink so all the cleaning stuff so these cupboards were given by them i didn't buy it or assemble it it's really good i'm just showing you to give an idea all the cooking stuff and everything sauce yeah so maybe i'll do only a kitchen tour one day the onion garlic some more utensils which are used regularly for heavy cooking so this is another heater this is the second small heater which also is controlled by the knob and it's a bit slower but that one is the very powerful heater so yeah all these things boards and everything i can also show you the ceiling and everything to give an idea like how high is the room i think it is decent it i should not say it is pretty much high but it is decent So if you see from my perspective it looks like this. Yeah. So going from here this also I got from IKEA. Going from here because this is my studio setup I can everything is connected by the smart lamp. So I have numbered it and I connect it by app so I can open the studio lamp when I turn on this colored lights. This is the magic that I was talking about. Let me switch off all my lights. See the smart switch that I made. I switch on my studio setup. Well, it looks nice. Switch off my studio setup. making videos you might have seen in many of the videos and we have the colored lights this is a additional heater sometimes in winter after midnight they switch it off and for 6 hours it is off sometimes i need it very rarely but it's better to have one it's like 40 some euros or euros uh, yeah so this is the way from that room so we came from this room to this room the total area of this house is between 40 to 45 meter square square meter and this is a stand which i 
I got it from someone who left the home on my top of my house to keep all this hang all this this is the bedroom let me show you the bedroom before I go to the bathroom so again every flooring is very hard this cupboard also I assembled it myself will be surprised the cupboard the bed everything all the furniture so the typical bed single bed and these are additional mattresses sometimes some friends come my parents came and we had to sleep because there is so much space in the front room as I showed you so we can use this flooring for sleeping one good thing is that uh, this floor if you have seen there was a big couch on this side which was air filled and I just put it because now I don't need it but it's here on the top so the couch is here wrapped protected all my suitcase and everything is on top of this cupboard and um, this cupboard is also assembled by me I don't think it will look that good but it has all the winter stuff everything and yeah it's really packed the suits and everything some additional bags some shoes candles there's many things this is one of the standing lamp for my video some of my video stuff is here I got a blender because one of my old blenders stopped working and I have not opened it yet this is the weighing machine I hope someday I lose some weight and this is the light that I use for video making videos the fan which you might have seen in many videos the green screen kind of a green screen this is the real green screen lying here another table which has laptop and stuff near my bed so I keep the phone and everything near yeah, so this room is a bit small the bigger living room has the kitchen and the study area and everything so you get a perspective again by the way this one if you are wondering is actually the, the drying rack so you can take it out open it and fold open the fold and dry the cloth, clothes this one is the private heater for me the boiler so to heat water so if it is finished then I just press this boost and it starts heating I can also change the mode if there are more people coming to have a better heating all these things including everything the electricity everything unlimited gas unlimited electricity everything and there are many things outside also I'll show you I pay like because it was unfurnished I arranged everything myself which is a lot of hassle initially but you pay less rent I was paying 500 in the first year and now I think I pay like around 600 hey, sorry 530 euros so you have a huge mirror on the door and this is a typical old-fashioned bathroom which is very dark yeah normal basin the latin and uh, here you can keep some cleaning stuff saving stuff the shower where luckily you don't have a curtain but you have a proper door which closes by a magnet so the water never comes out whenever you are in the shower you have another heater it's really nice so the bathroom is also hot so you don't feel any cold you can hang stuff here and this washing machine also I bought it has washer and dryer so imagine what would happen when you nothing was there in this house so yeah so I also kind of furnished my bathroom you have only one light and when you turn it on there is a exhaust fan which turns on and it remains on for few minutes even after switching off the light that's how it works to take out all the smell or anything Yeah, here it's the reverse if you are thinking this is off this is on off on some places you have that when it's old oh by the way there is also a light here so if you're hanging stuff you can use it I use it very rarely because I get light from that room and also from the living room the entrance 
so i hope you like this video if you like this video don't forget to smash the like button share this video subscribe to the channel if you have not subscribed till next video goodbye from netherlands